and we're cook garlic sweet today lots of garlic and I already marinated this sweet Basically, I marinate the squid with a lemon pepper, thyme, salt, a little bit of uh, I mean, a little bit of salt, and I have a adobo seasoning. You can choose any. There we go. All-purpose adobo seasoning. You can choose any 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 kind of all-purpose seasoning. I mean, even it's not all-purpose. Whatever you prefer. So, you just simmer it for a while. And you will be right back. So guys, as you can see, it's boiling. And our squid shrink already. Which color change. So what we're going to do, we're going to boil it some more until we reduce the sauce i didn't put any water here the squid will uh will make some liquid it's it have natural liquid so we'll reduce that so probably um 15 to 20 minutes and i'll show you it reduce Oh wait, before I forget, I need to, I'm gonna add bay leaves. Two bay leaves will be fine. It will add aroma and flavor and cayenne pepper. I like it with a little bit of spicy. So today I'm not gonna put onion, it's just garlic and other seasoning. Norm um most of the time I put some tomatoes, but this time just as simple as that. So guys it's been boiling for 15 minutes. As you could see, our squid already shrink and it's ready to cook. And the sauce is perfectly reduced and that's what we need just like that just a little bit of sauce so the flavor it's there it's soaking in our squid so basically gar a lot of garlic you're gonna saute it in um, oil bay leaves I put a double seasoning or any kind of seasoning that you prefer salt and pepper and lemon pepper you could squeeze a fresh lemon as well if you want if you prefer that and you could ha add some um, lemon crust but I did not put today and my favorite seasoning thyme I don't know I, I do really love the flavor of this thyme um, dried thyme even fresh thyme is good and what else but right now it's this one is ready to serve I'm gonna add for before we turn off the heat we're gonna add some parsley flakes lots of parsley flakes and if you have a green onion to put on top of this before you serve that's perfect so that's it so garlic saute squid simple recipe this is for lunch if you like this page if you like this recipe hit like um, share and don't forget to subscribe guys thank you thank you for watching bon appetit